before before we start up with the video, don't forget to click that subscribe button right over here. And that the way, let's get out to the video. Hi, sorry, he says, hello, ugh. hello, by my name is Screaming Alex, and welcome back once again to Little Misfortune. I love this game a lot. It does have its horror moments, and I love that as well, but the comedy aspect of it... I've played some. I've played a lot of like serious horror games, so it's always refreshing to have a little comedic one every now and then. Now I don't know what's going on with this menu screen because I don't know who the hell this guy with the crow is and the antlers. I don't know. I know it's not the guy with the horns from Frambo because he had horns, not antlers. So it was like antlers. Well, there's only one way to find out. Let's get into the game, shall we? So last time we got done with uh, Phantasmagoria. A little horror festival, that was fun. Oh, and we caused the Grim Reaper to jump into the ocean and drown. <laughs> That's always fun. Oh, this place does not look fun. Robot toys. <gasps> Check that out. It's the toy graveyard, I'm telling you. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune. It definitely is. What time is it? It's getting really dark. Mr. Voice, are you there? Hello? There's something wrong here. Something very wrong. What's wrong, Mr. Voice? What do you mean? It's coming. <clears throat> hide. Hide. I don't know what you're playing, but if you scare me, I'll close my eyes. Hero! Hero? Hero! What is with these ghost kids? Ugh. What happened to these kids that go missing? This is very ominous. Seriously? Oh damn it! My little foot got stuck. It's like yeah, it's like stuck under one of the roots. Oh, the monster, what Roy? is that? Can you see? Can you see it? <sighs> Leave me alone. First off, where is Mr. Voice? And who's what? Okay, a giant monster hand. <laughs> Was the fox. That was not a fox! It's a I saw it again! Again? You don't know what you're talking about. Yes, I do. I Narrator, you don't know what you're talking about, man! <laughs> what the? Benjamin? Don't make any sudden moves. What the hell were you. I. Uh, fuck it, get up. Oh, your boss, so soft. Don't touch her with your filthy paws, you beast. Stop it, you're scaring him away. I don't know what's going on, I don't know who to trust. Don't leave, Benjamin. Narrator, what the hell was that, man? Did you not see the monster? What? Okay. Please, Miss Fortune, stop and listen to me. There's something I need to tell you. If you keep running, you'll end up badly hurt, and I don't want that. You're too important. But I want to find Benjamin. Why exactly are we important? Me. Trust me, he's dangerous. Stop running, please. <laughs> I I don't know. I, I'm I don't trust the voice. <gasps> oh, that was close. Really? You don't remember me saying if you keep running, you'll end up hurt. I don't. Hurt. No, I don't trust you, Mr. Voice. I know. I could have been more specific. Like, there's a bear trap up ahead. Stop, or you will be hurt. But I felt like getting straight to the point. Okay, okay. Thank you. Who left the bear trap here anyway? I haven't seen any bears. Well, I don't want to point any finger. What is with your obsession with the fox? I swear, there is something there. I don't like the fox. I have what you call foxophobia. Is that true? Yes, I swear. Now, let's focus on foxyphobia. happiness again. <laughs> All right. 
Okay, I looked up Foxophobia, and I'm just seeing pictures of Foxy from Finance of Phrase. Okay, yeah, that's uh, the internet. That's all I can say is internet. I don't know what's with the heart thing. We have the stone for this. This one looks like the other one that didn't look like the other ones. You see? Yes. So you know. Yes. <laughs> now what does this say? Look, huh? The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the band. Oh, really interesting. I don't fully know what that means, but okay. When you said it was stuck, so I can't get it back. It's stuck, huh? Well, that sucks. I almost missed it all. Number six, yes! The games you enjoy, you can have them all. The games you enjoy? You can have them all. Oh, nice. What are you doing? Nothing. So, Miss Fortune, <sighs> I have a couple of questions for you. More questions, you jeez. Yeah, I'm ready. Wonderful. Now, just be honest and think about it before answering. First question. Do you believe in magic? In this world, yes. You believe in magic? <laughs> yes, yes, I do. Whoops. When mommy and daddy scream, I go to my secret hiding spot. Uh, oh. And in my secret box, they never drink juice and never scream at me. That's magic. Oh, oh, yes. Damn. Yes, it is. I'm so That's sorry. I'm so sorry, Miss Fortune. On. Second question Do you trust me? No, but I'm not going to tell you that to your face. I'm going to say yes. I guess. I can only hear you in my head. And I trust my own head. So, yeah. That makes me so happy to hear, Miss Fortune. I don't trust them, actually. Anyway. Now, for the third... They ask me if I trust a fox. Are you afraid of dying? Ay, yai, yai. These questions are much. <laughs> yes. Yes, I am. I don't know if I will like being dead. It's like too mysterious, you know? What if I can't bring my glitter? Well, I guess you'll find out when you die. I don't trust the voice. I don't trust him. Oh no, I hope it doesn't rain that much. I don't like my feet getting wet. I'm a little lady, you know? Again with that phrase. That's literally like your number one hey, phrase. look at that. I think we're here. Benjamin! Stay cool, Miss Fortune. I'm cool. I'll keep an eye out here while you go inside and look for clues. I'm sure the fox has hidden the eternal happiness here. Make sure the cabin is empty, and if you see the fox, run. All right. I don't trust the fucking voice. Oh, it looks like Benjamin's good at cutting wood. He must be so muscular. <laughs> Stop fangirling now, come on. We got work to do. Be brave, Miss Fortune. Okay, I will look around. Maybe I can find my eternal happiness. If Benjamin has it, I ask him to share that prize with us and everything will be fine. I don't know if he has it or not, that's the thing. Is this Benjamin's? He got some sweet style. I like it. Whoa, a video player. Bonsu! Oh! Let's see. In the woods. <gasps> Benjamin's on TV? <laughs> Is that the monster? Oh, that was a monster. Benjamin's tape. The monster is after us. Do you want the antlers? Maybe I can fix it. Interesting. Glitter. Happiness to the video player! Ah, <laughs> oh, what a cozy couch. Is that Benjamin's diary? Read it. 
gonna have a little look inside. I Benjamin Julius Juhanelius Red Fox. I Benjamin Juhanelius Red. Juhanelius. I knew his name was Benjamin. I must make dangerous mission. Mission must be done. Is what I trained to make. Nervous, but is okay. I've studied. I has study and bigger confidence. I travel from. Serenseti. Bain door when fog appears. Wait, give me a second, y'all. Yeah, give me a second, y'all. I got a notification. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I'm back. I go do so things. So Benjamin is not from open fields? I bet he has an accent. I love that in a fox. Yeah, travel from Serenseti to Bain door when fog appears. That's the realms. If you guys remember in uh, Frame Bow, there's five realms. The worlds where the tree guys was just if Serta? Pandora's Earth. S Primevia. I think that was named the one with all the like mask guys. And then Sinerceti. Isn't that the world of death? Yeah, I think that's because is that where uh what's so name? Itward comes from? I bet he has an accent. I huh. love that in a fox. I don't know if I'm right or not, but... I think now we're finally connecting to Frambo. I pack things of food. No information on how long stay. I rent cabin to work done. My task important. Boss told me my many victims in town. I need courage. After a long walk in fog, I rise city. Called Open Fields. Tiny town has good forest. Cabin very nice. Has TV, kitchen, I sleep sofa. I decorate cabin. Fish balls smell funny. Eat mushrooms in the woods. I refresh after sleep. Try to find parasite. Did not find it. They won't fail. Parasite, you say? Who are the victims? What gang? Then he's afraid of the parasite. Many victims gone missing in parasite game? I can't help. Feel sad. I send a message to boss. Some victims not coming to Sinner City? I see parasite. It scared me. Also, not eat much more. Eat more mushrooms. Stomach ache and much gas. Is no good. Don't eat the mushrooms again. Parasite king. The parasites talk about is the oh, the antlers, the monster. Oh shit. Oh wait a minute. Oh wait a minute. I think I might have an idea over here. Many victims gone missing in parasite game. These victims are paying, were playing a game. So these kids that were missing, they were missing because they were playing a game with Parasite, which is the antler guy. Oh, wait a minute. Holy shit. Wait a minute. Misfortune's playing a game right now. Misfortune's playing a game to find eternal happiness. Holy shit, I think Mr. Voice might be the parasite. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. That would explain why he didn't talk when the monster was trying to grab us with his giant hand. And the way Mr. Voice has been acting, especially after the whole hand thing. Oh, shit. I think Mr. Voice might be the parasite, God of Antlers. It's mostly just a fury right now, but I don't know. Mushroom, serious danger. I not feel good. Danger, mushroom. I stay home, cut wood, and do tea and root soup. Good taste. I do dolls for victims and pictures if she sees them good. Parasite I recognize. Margo, code P O one O one two two two. It likes to play. It has, I has guide for steps. Courage, Mar. Now rest until stomach good. Yeah, Miss Fortune's playing a game designed by Miss by Mr. Voice. My internal happiness. I'm starting to think that Mr. Voice might be Parasite. Morgo. Feeling no stomach aches, only gas. I go help missing victims in town. Morgo, no, I'm here. Morgo play old trick many times now. But make mistake, one victim can hear. 
its voice inside her head. Victim code misfortune! Mr. Voices Margo! Oh, I called it! Oh! My god! This entire time! I know I didn't trust the voice at all. It's acting way too weird about way too many things. But I called it! I called he was suspicious! Mr. Voice is Margo! The one caused all the kids to go missing! One victim can hear its voice inside her head. Misfortune. Margo can't have her say, boss. She must be rescued by foul steps. I saw Margo take shape. Scary. Margo's inside Miss Fortune's head. Mr. Voice is Morgo. Uh, missing a voice? It's a monster. Oh, poor Benji. Boss sent me a message. Watch victim house. I sleep outside house. Hide in trash. I fa failed to find parasite. It did not come to big trouble. Miss Fortune, watch me. Strange. Big trouble? Miss Fortune? But that's me. I bet he's in love with me. No, he's trying to protect you from Mr. Voice. Mr. Voice is Morgo. Why she see me? She big eyes. I run away. Felt warm in my in stomach. Maybe mushroom tickle again? Or maybe he is in love with her. I see Morgo play old trick again. Victim don't realize all is again. All is again must courage and stop Parasite this time. I send many victims to Saren Seti. I got a level 2 protector. I confident. Now I has Primeve Illumination Cane. Primeve? Primeve, that's isn't that the world with the mask guys? So before I'm getting this. That Fox Man is from Serenity, the same world as Itward, and helps guide like souls to the afterlife, or I can tell. And Mr. Fox gained this little stick staff thing from Prime, which is I think it's the world with the mask guys. There isn't really a image of Serta here, and of course Pandora's Earth are on. I don't know what the fifth realm is called, I can't remember. But I think Morgo might be from the same world as like the the guy with the horns, the big guy from Frambo, the evil giant demon like guy with the horns. Because it seems. Because there are some similarities between Morigo and the big guy with the horns. Damn, this game is good. I try, I try Primeve Illumination Cane in Woods. Fun. I feel courage. I have to seem to help Miss Fortune. I see she makes too much talk. I think she's fun and strong. Morgo confused by charms of misfortune. I did video picking wood and pairs I came. But I'm cursed now. I scared only little. Hmm. Yes, I know how to talk. He loves me. I met his boss. I'm doing it today. All steps follow. Prepare breakfast tea. Funny feeling with tea. Herbs from woods are fun. If Benji has a boss, he has a job. Then I can be married to him. I'm cursed and confident today. I ready. Mr. Voice, I know your secret. You're Margo! You're the one causing these kids to go missing! Bruh. Ooh. That was a whole. The, give me a second, y'all. Give me a second. That was a whole entire. I'm saving. That was an entire story dump right there, because. Oh my god, that was a whole entire twist! Oh my god. Looks like Benjamin likes to educate. Yeah, after life, so we had to be like great. <laughs> Just in case, it might be copyright. <laughs> Some tea. No, don't mm, drink any. That tea smells like roses and lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blonde. Because I can almost smell his boss blending the ingredients. Maybe I okay, should stop try simping that. now. Now nah, let's try it. Stop simping for Benjamin already. Mm. It definitely tastes like his fluffy boss. Mm. 
delicious. Oh. oh, I feel weird. Let me guess, herbal tea. What the? Yep, herbal tea. I love sandwich. Seriously. Actually, I'm pretty hungry myself. Damn. Uh, I'm gonna wipe your mouth. Oh, for y'all. Jeez, you're both some messy ears. Come on. This is very weird. What's with all the flies? And now they're flying in the air using glitter. Crows. Yeah, just do some glitter. Look at that. Benjamin looks so pretty in that hat. <laughs> Stop it with the simping now, come on. <gasps> Benjamin! I'm <laughs> really sorry I broke your video player, but you stole the eternal happiness. It was promised to me if I beat the game. I really want to. More goes game. We can totally share it if you want. Are you afraid of the thunder, Benjamin? Don't worry, you can hold my hand if you want to. Oh, what are you? Is this a kiss? Is this really happening? What is that? Your diary! I'm sorry if you're upset because I read it, but I was curious. Is it the monster Morgo, in the yes! you're afraid of? Morgo is Mr. Voice! Morgo is Mr. Voice. You can't hide the children. Uh oh, he's here. Follow Benjamin. Are you rescuing me? I trust Benjamin? him. Like if I was a girl in trouble. This does like a torture chamber, though. So it was Benjamin placing these. Probably but not Benjamin for. Seems so nice. Maybe he put them for the monster. Yeah, I was about monster. to say. It's for Morgo, Mr. Voice. Hmm, kind of fish balls. This is like sushi balls. Maybe. I've never really eaten. I've never heard of sushi balls hmm. before. A picture of a key. Interesting. My ninja senses are telling me to climb up on this chair. And climb up? Hmm, a real ninja lady always touches everything. <laughs> a secret button. And one way All to find right out what then, it does. I push the button. Guess he opens this. Yep. Jeez, is Morgo destroying the entire cabin or something? That was easy. Alright, time to find Bangy. Yeah, I trust him since I know he wor oh, he's from the same world as Itward. Fortunate. I hope things get better when I get the eternal happiness. Okay, Miss Fortune. Get up, Miss Fortune. Seriously, we're doing an entire like. You are stronger than you think. What is this? A Rocky mantra or something? You've been knocked down before. If she yells Adrian, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> Did you let that stop you? Come on, okay. Get up, Miss Fortune. You can do it. How many more times do I have to do this? Come on. Because. Jesus, just say the sentence. Because. Because you're about to die. You are the little lady misfortune. The little misfortune. <laughs> now let's go find Benjamin. He's the only one who probably can help us. Because I trust him completely now. Well, not okay. like completely, but I, I trust him. You know what? I trust him. I trust Bangy? him. Mr. Voice? 
I guess I'm alone. I trust Benjamin. But since we know Mr. Oh, Voice's real identity. Baby dear. So sweet. Dream come true. Got a pet it here. I'm petting the baby dear. <laughs> Bada boom. Is that Benjamin's bag? Uh -oh. Benjamin? Are you around? He must be in trouble. I'm very disappointed in Margo. his fortune. Ah, there you are. Hey, have you seen Benjamin? I think he's in trouble. Didn't you hear what I just said? I'm very disappointed in you. Mr. Voice, please stop playing games. You have lied to me all the time, and that's very sucky. I trusted you. What are you talking about? I read what Benjamin wrote in his diary. All of it. You're the one taking the children, and I... I'm not the hero of this game, right? No. I guess the eternal happiness was all a lie. Stop this nonsense. We have to keep playing my game. You can't More go. me. Yes, I can. Stop that! Then play with me. You need to find your eternal happiness. I'll give you a clue. It's at home, waiting for you. I'm sick of that eternal happiness. I don't want it anymore. You can't say that. That would break the rules. You heard me. I don't want the eternal happiness anymore. I won't tolerate this behavior. I'll be waiting for you at home. Now, tell me where Benjamin is. What do you do to him? Freaking monster. Let's see what's inside. Maybe a clue where to find me. At the end of the road, you Wait, what about six? You already said I already get six. A deal. a deal, you say? <laughs> oh, okay, now that is adorable. <laughs> is that Benjamin as a baby? <laughs> so cute. Oh, this is really mysterious. Okay. For students of the University of Serenstedt Technology, Protector Course, Free Step Guide, Free Step Guide to Exterminate Parasitic Beings from the Beyond. Introduction. As the old reality forms enhance the concept of time, new realms outside the constituted free five realms of central existence have appeared. Out of the Ultra War, thousands of beings were discovered as byproducts of war. They created for themselves a new realm, referred to it as the Beyond. The Beyond is, in simple terms, a place of extreme absurdity of neurological laws or physics. We can't allow such beings inside it free at the moment, since the foundation of our reality is based in energetic and ethical values of the Ultra Reality. Before the Ultra War, the Beyond is still a misunderstood realm. We have yet found the pieces connected with it in a logical manner. The few patterns we recognize are the behaviors of some fish, also known as parasites. They normally enter the free reality, Pandora. They seek fresh meat to lure into the beyond. How many is there? Jesus. That's why we need protectors. Protectors are the only ones with the capability of seeing the imbalance between realms and using the tools available inside the old reality. Protectors will help victims and guide them into Saren City. The guy's pride in the book must be followed with great responsibility. Never skip a step for each victim protector returns to Saren City. Your protector will be rewarded with new levels, tools, and more steps to follow. Step 1. Protector must locate victim parasite. The protector must locate the victim in a parasite. What is parasite? More ago. Uh, the victim is in need of assistance itself in step 2. Got to his or identity, but it's already dead, but it's not really easy illusions, but not real. Survives through parasites, okay? Deforms reality to absurdity. Parasite seems friendly, yet lures victims to play dangerous games. It chases to a human animal creature who learns about environment, language, and culture are not an issue for his parasite. Large flocks of black birds are peeled near the parasite. These birds and eyes of Marco give him an overview of his playing ground. It helps victim become aware of his That's why he doesn't talk. It is strictly forbidden to interact directly with the victim. It could lead to invisible trauma inside the victim's mind. If your parasite kills the victim, you will need to proceed step free immediately. With the what? Now I will never know. Crap, yeah.
first. <laughs> I guess that counts for that. But here's the thing I want to look at. I'm going to save real quick because there's one thing I wanted to look at. Let me go back to main menu. Uh, dolls. One, two. One, two, three, four, five. Five, six, seven. Oh, there's only nine dolls. I just need two more. Okay, let me go back to where I was. Man, this game. This game really went to places and I absolutely love it. Uh, let me do this real quick again. There's only two more dolls. Margo. Do you have something you wish to say to me? Oh no, it's Benjamin. Thanks for the doll. Alright, I guess I'll take the train back home. <sighs> now when I look at this, I can see what Benjamin tried to warn me about. Monster. He knew all along. More go. Such a foxy boy. Benjamin was trying to help us. He just couldn't directly talk to us. Oh, Sigurd Fada said front. I was about to say. <gasps> okay, I'll wait here. Waiting, waiting for a little while. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna talk to myself. Oh, okay. So, Miss Fortune, how have you been? Okay, I have this like where they i saw monsters i saw dolls i saw benjamin and then i went to the zoo and everything was everywhere and then i realized mr voice had lied to me a mr lot. voice is morgo and he took benjamin and now i'm alone he didn't take benjamin I don't like being alone wow sounds like you had one hell of a day miss fortune yeah the train is here it was a nice chat, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Talk to you later. You go, girl. <laughs> Hero. I haven't done one of these coloring books in years. Try and stay within the lines. Try and stay within the lines. Do, 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 do. I hit over the line. Okay. <laughs> I'm feeling inspired. You've been through quite a day. It's understandable. Little hero. I didn't recognize you. <laughs> oh, you're one of the victims. Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You're one of the victims. Know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. But I don't think it's a voice anymore. No, it's I'm the sure monster. It's the monster. It I is. saw it in a book at Benjamin's place. Really creepy. Have you ever heard voices in your head? What the? What is that? <laughs> okay. I know Hira. What does it mean? Hira, what does go? It's the monster. Leave Hira alone. Toskada. Toskada. Give me a minute. Okay, so I literally just looked up what Tasuketi means, and it means help. It means help. Okay. Help the man! Tasuketi! Help the man! Morgo. 
Bro, I need to find Benjamin's staff because I need to just shove that through your eye. If you have an eye? I mean, you have birds. I don't know, but man. I hope I get to see Hiro again. I wonder what that monster did to him. Ugh. Now I have to walk all the way back home alone. This is the last time I follow a voice in my head. If Benjamin <laughs> was here, he would walk with me. Ugh. Okay, give me a minute. I'm gonna look up one more thing. Kibe wa doku desu, ha? Roughly means where are? What? Am I spelling that right? I looked up what it means, and it means where is the fog? The diary mentioned fog. Mentioned a fog. Interesting. I think it has something to do with Saren said east. Kick the can. Kick the can. Hello, people. Excuse me. I'm talking over here. Well, if that's how you treat the little lady, Yo, talk to me, man. Give yourself a fuck. Why are you not talking to me? That's just kind of rude. More goes birds. More go. Shall we? Let's see where the story goes from here. Huh? Where's the car? Is Daddy gone again? Maybe it is late at night. That red light is just so menacing. We got red lights. I like them. It's a bit menacing. Nice arm pop and neck pop. Mommy, I'm back. Hello? Is mom dead? What's that sound? Benji? It's most definitely not Benji. Where is a thing? Bookshelves? Hello? Mommy? Benji? What happened here? Are we in... Oh, that's not good. Congratulations, you reached the end of my game. Let me More go. I'm looking for mommy and Benjamin. There's no eternal happiness for you. I don't even care anymore. Of course you care. You know your mommy needs it. It's your responsibility. Yes, I guess you're right. Good, good. Ready for a new game? If I play along. Will you give me back Benjamin? I guess I will. But only if you truly commit to the game. Okay. Splendid. You will love my new game. We're back here? This is where the this game started. Is Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. Morgo, what are you doing? And a little sparkle for you. Wait a minute. Didn't I do this already? Yes, what? you already did. No, you're not doing this correctly. Then you say something She's like playing Stanley game Parable. Game, which is totally not true, by the way. <clears throat> Wait. Stop talking, please. Are we going to play another game? Or is this like what? I don't understand. If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. And then you say deal, and I say yes. Stop ruining this! Uh, eternal happiness? No deal! Wonderful. Fantastic. Ready to... wait. What? No, no deal. deal. No. No. Uh, how about this? What if the fox was waiting for you in the hallway? If the game is about Benjamin and you leaving me alone, I'll play along. Sure, sure. I promise. You know the way. 
I don't... <sighs> if Mr. Boy scares me again, I'm gonna run and hide in here. I don't think that's gonna work too well, but okay. Okay, I'm just gonna play his game one last time. Are you stuck in an infinite loop? Or what? This time, I'm not running. Okay, I, I said I'm not gonna run, but... Oh no, not again. You promised he wouldn't be like last time. That was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Ma, you lied to me. I don't want to play this game anymore. Fine. Let me come up with a new game to play. New game. Knock, knock. Who's there? No, I don't want to play with you anymore. Knock, knock. Who's there? I don't want to know. You're scaring me. Stop it. Leave me alone. Run. 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 What happened here? My secret spot. He won't find me in there. Open this door right now, Miss Fortune. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Oh, sweet uni. Okay, so my game crashed mid cutscene. So let's try and go back to the cutscene. Here we go. Come on, Miss Fortune. Open this door right now, Miss Fortune. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. I don't want to play with you, Morgo. Leave. Oh, sweet unicorn. Please take me to your rainbow kingdom. Ah! So now we're playing hide and seek. I love that game. No, leave me alone. All right. Just so you know, my game is the only thing keeping you alive. What? Is that one more of your lies? Most likely, yes. I will live forever with Benjamin, and there's nothing I mean, you can do about it. I don't think you're going to be live forever. <laughs> Please stop talking about that fox. He's been trying to take you away from me all the time. And his ugly paintings. Ugh. Oh no, you don't talk like that about my Benjamin. Yeah, you he tried to help us. I'm done with you. I want you to leave. Right now. You don't have a clue about what's going on. This is not the last game you play with me, Miss Fortune. This is only the beginning. Ah! Mine of their goat feet. You silly little oh. child. Another toy for my collection. That is not good. You're mine to play with for eternity. I'm sick of you being a bully. You'll see, Benjamin will come back and save me. No, we made a deal. You crossed the path, and now you're mine. Benjamin! My man! Benjamin! Uh. <laughs> Seriously? How did you get here? There's nothing you can do. <laughs> Is it just me or does this actually look somewhat like a, a metal al album? <laughs> like a fucking rock cover album? <gasps> Even the music in the background. <laughs> and I'm taking every second to take as many screenshots I can. This is some good, like, thumbnail right here. No. No! Take the power to Permeave, my guy! The power to Permeave will stop you, boy! Are you back to normal? Is anything normal again? A 
Is everything back to normal now? Benjamin saved me. Benji, are you around? No, but here's one of his dolls. This one should be number eight. Number eight. Mortigo is coming. Open your eyes. He is the head in your voice, driving you mad. Mortigo is coming. Mortigo. Open your eyes. He is the voice in your head, driving you mad. Well, now I know what to call Mr. Voice. Mortigo. Benjamin, did you go outside? I guess I have to rebuild this. I'll make some improvements. Yeah, I was about to say, it's but not going to take too long to do that. To find Benjamin. Let's go find a man. Benjamin, where are you? Is that to symbolize Morgo being gone, or...? October 11th. Mommy! She I'm looks back. sad? Mommy, don't ignore me. Are you angry because I couldn't get the happiness for you? She seems sad. Is she talking to the police? What's happening? That way turned to ghost? <laughs> I don't under... This must be a bad dream. I don't understand. Now they turned to ghost? <gasps> Glitter bottle. The sleeves. Misfortune's been dead the entire time. That's why people have been ignoring her. She's been a ghost the entire time. We've been dead for the entire time. Holy shit. We've been dead the entire time. I'm saving because, oh my god. That's us. The hair to sleep the glitter. Is that... When you're crossing the road, you got killed by a car. Oh no, what have I done? You've been a ghost the entire time. <laughs> you did say we would die at the end, and we've been dead the entire time. You've been fighting so you would get our soul. Oh, Bengi, you're back. I thought I lost you too. What's this? What? What's happening? He's like... Oh. We need to go? Alright. I'm dead. He's basically trying to help my soul go to Seren City. Like he did with the other victims. Thank you, wait. Oh. Are you taking me somewhere else? Because I have nothing against it. But I have to talk with my mommy first. Mommy, I'm going to go somewhere else. With Bengi, okay? He's the fox that I like. I'm a little lady, you know? That's what I am. You're a little lady. I, guess I was your little misfortune for a while, but you need to find your own happiness now. I love you forever.
Oh, I expected it just be the straight up credits. Wait, stop, Benjamin. Where are we going? We're Benjamin? in the fog. The fog that Hiro was talking about. Oh, Papi! I'm so happy to see you again. Hey, Wait puppy. for me, Papi! Oh. Pinecone guys. Oh. A reaper snail looking guy. I mean slug, not snail. Oh. The pig beetles! I remember them! Pig beetles! Guys, who become butterflies? It word. Oh. Hi, it word. It is really good to see you, it word. And into the fog. Oh, this place is really cold. Of the puppy. You finally got to pet the puppy. I guess now you ring the bell. Oh. Uh, I think I'm missing a few things. All around disasters seem to disappear deep inside a fog. You defeat him. All around disasters seem to disappear deep inside the fog. You defeat him. Huh. I guess Mr. Voice game is over now. Benji? <sighs> Sorry, had a yawn. This is what happens when you're tired. I don't know why, but... Who are you? I'm a little lady. Miss Fortune. That's who I am. Lady Miss Fortune? Yes, you could say that. Good. Step inside. We were expecting you. It's like we're still missing like four crystals. I guess these four things we had to use glitter on. Somewhere else achievement unlocked. Is this it? Yep. What's with the whole crystal things on the tree? Nothing after crits? Did I miss anything? I got all these. Give me, I'm gonna look it up real quick. Okay, I found a video that will show us what exactly happens if we find all the things we need to use glitter on. So, let's watch it. What exactly happens? Because I don't want to replay the entire game all over again, try and find all the glitter stuff. Okay. Just 
Miss Fortune's mom. Oh, for eternal happiness. Hey, Mama Fortune. Damn, now I wish I did find all the glitter things. Very heartwarming ending. Okay, well. Gotta say, this was a really fun game. Let me see, y'all trying to... What the... Okay, there we go. That was a really fun game. I like that game a lot. That was a lot of fun. I do kind of wish I'd gotten all the glitter things. First try. Because that like little ending. The demon game, Eternal Happiness. Very heartwarming. This was a very fun game. I love its comedic parts. It blended very well since I mostly played a lot of serious horror games. So it was fun to have a little lightheartedness to it. And while Miss Fortune might be dead, her mom has eternal happiness. I do love its connections to Frambo with the five realms and such. Well, thank guys so much for watching. Don't like, comment, and subscribe. And guys have any gaming recommendations, I'll do leave your comments down below. But till then, I'll see you guys next episode. Stay awesome. Up next. Man of Madan.